I go with you, Father? Courage, my boy. You wait just here. I will return when this hand reaches the top. Father! Your father was an assassin, Arno. He gave his life, fight for the liberty of all mankind. to do with his death. But you did. How could I have known? Just go. I'm tired of running from my failures. Monsieur de la Serre, my father. Out of the dark you come into the light. From the light you will return to the dark. Are you prepared to travel the eagle's path? Yes. Rise. King of Beggars and Siver were only pawns in a larger game. Someone sent them after Monsieur de la Serre. He wants you dead, Elise. What? You want to protect me? I want to help you. I've come to ask for your help. It's a trick to make us lower our guard. Took you long enough, piss pot. Belek. Should have known it'd be you that find me. You poisoned Mirabeau. He poisoned us. Peace with the Templars is a fairy tale. And you're the only one who can save the Brotherhood? We can. Together. This is why I joined the Brotherhood. For revenge. For redemption. I'm not leaving you here to die. It's not Mirabeau that's poisoned your mind, it's her. Elise! The vote is cast and counted, Grandmaster. The king will die. Arno Dorian. Your rank and title are stripped from you, and you are hereby exiled from the Brotherhood of Paris. He's getting away! Away from me! I'm sorry. Elise! seems. The culmination of five long years, a moment of revenge. So why can I not quiet this part of me which fears that, at the tipping point, you will flinch? Rather, I fear that you have lost so much already that you cannot bear to lose more. I think that you would let Germain rule France if you thought it would save me. My fate is my own. My choice is my own. If somehow we both return from this, I will burn this letter. If you are reading it now, then I made my choice there in the temple. Know that I made it gladly, and do not take the burden of it onto yourself. Be at peace, my love, and walk what path you will. All my love, Elise. The creed of the Assassin Brotherhood teaches us that nothing is forbidden to us. Once, I thought that meant we were free to do as we would, to pursue our ideals no matter the cost. I understand now. Not a grant of permission, the creed is a war. Ideals too easily give way to dogma. Dogma becomes fanaticism. No higher power sits in judgment of us. No supreme being watches to punish us for our sins. In the end, only 
Only we ourselves can guard against our obsessions. Only we can decide whether the road we walk carries too high at all. We believe ourselves redeemers, avengers, saviors. We make war on those who oppose us, and they in turn make war on us. We dream of leaving our stamp upon the world. Even as we give our lives in a conflict that will be recorded in no history. All that we do, all that we are, begins and ends with ourselves. Maybe we can't go back, but going forward isn't necessarily an ending.